started. I'm getting ready to gas up. Go repo them for like three days straight and go rest for a day and then come back out. You know, I ain't been home since uh, 12 o'clock yesterday. And we basically like police. We do stakeouts. You know what I'm saying? I stake people out. I got this dude from the motel. I watched him go inside the motel, get ready to get busy, and got his ass. You just, you gotta hustle. It's just like selling fucking dope. You know what I'm saying? Motherfuckers out here selling dope is how much work you put in this shit. If you don't hustle, you ain't gonna get no money. Believe that. That's the life of a repo, man. And uh, we finna go on a hell of a ride. So come on. I'm gonna give you a layout of my truck. This is a 2500 uh, Chevy HD. This is a top of the line repo truck. I reinforce the uh, back of this truck. So if I get a heavy load, I just go inside. I got a, a clutch pump inside. I could just, it'll go up. You know what I'm saying? When I go out of town or something, I got a navigation system in here. I'll punch up any address, any address, and I find it. Got a backup camera on here. I got a remote control. Put, just pull up to a car, go across the street, hide behind the tree, and snatch the truck. Because you got to be crazy to do this shit. Stealing people's cars. So basically, you're stealing, but it's legal. So this is my whole routine every night. I go in the store, give me some Hennessy, bag of ice, a Red Bull, just to give me energy in case I gotta put somebody in a police chokehold. And then some to snack on. Give me some pistachios. I'm getting ready to pour me a cup of this. I do everything in the back of the truck. Sometimes one of the homeboys might pass by and come shoot the shit with me for a minute, but you know. Don't 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 turn Hollywood on these motherfuckers, man. You niggas get a little money and they get Hollywood. You know what I'm saying? I keep it real, man. I don't give a fuck your blood, cuz, crip, anything. I don't give a fuck. You know what I'm saying? Niggas gotta get their money. Snoop ain't gonna come fuck with y'all. Mac 10 ain't gonna come fuck with y'all. Ice Cube ain't gonna come fuck with y'all. You know what I'm saying? None of them niggas ain't gonna do that shit, man. Yeah, for sure. So shit, y'all keep it hood, homie. I'm out. <laughs> All right, man. For sure. Well, basically, we was around the corner at the address where the car was supposed to be, su supposed to be, and it wasn't there. So I just usually I ride hit ride around corners. They be having other relatives' house. They can park park the car three or four blocks away. So I just ride. So ba and basically we just was riding around down the street and I seen a silver Chevy sil uh, Silverado. So and with the with the car lot that I get the car from plate. So I think this is it. And they got the the VIN number blocked. So they hiding something. And my guy got in the car. I do it. She gonna try to jump in. She gonna try to jump back in this car. 
this car car go. I got it. <laughs> man, that's why I don't like messing with these black girls, man. They crazy. Shit. Oh, her person here too. Well, she's gonna have to get that from the finance company. I'm gone. We in the hood, man. We ain't playing. We ain't playing. Don't know repo men do it like I do. You know, they scared to come in here. If you up all night, you gonna make money. If you up for about six hours and you go to sleep, you ain't gonna make no money. This is what I call my nigga beater. I made this. I put a little rope around it. So in case I have to hit somebody, it won't it'll stay on my arm. I put a nail inside of it. So it'd be hard. Just because I repo cars, that don't mean this man can do it. They think, okay, this dude can do it, I can do it. I mean, that's a good way to think of shit, but hey, this is this is some crazy shit right here. I don't care about being a star. I just want to make some cheese, man. So I'm coming to a hood near you. 